All right, what's up skiers? This is Joe Johnson here with Alta Ski Area. We are back on the lift. This week we are joined by Miss Claire Smallwood. Claire, how's it going? Wonderful, beautiful day up here at Alta. Seriously, couldn't ask for anything better, bluebird skies. Claire, let's kick it off. Give us a little background on yourself. Give us the, the down and dirty, where are you from? How old you are? When did you come to Alta? Ooh, my age. Just kidding. <laughs> uh, born and raised in Santa Fe, New Mexico. My family, I'm actually fifth generation New Mexican. My whole family still lives there and farms and ranches, which is super cool. I'm 28 uh, and uh, I've been living here at Alta for seven years full time. I went to college in Oregon at Lewis and Clark and uh, love to travel, cook, speak foreign languages, ski. Live the Renaissance life, I guess you could nice. say. Nice. <laughs> How many foreign languages do you speak? Uh, French, Spanish, and then this African language called Wolof. I studied abroad in Senegal and West Africa and picked it up. So, Smokes. and then I got English pretty good. Pretty good. <laughs> Mind blown. A West African language. That's pretty impressive right there. It was pretty fun. Nice. <laughs> so, let's talk about She Jumps. You are the co founder and executive director of She Jumps. Tell us a little bit about this organization. Yeah, for sure, Joe. So basically, Lindsay Dyer, Vanessa Pierce, and I got together um, in 2007 and decided that we needed to create a community where women could be included in all sorts of outdoor activities and feel really supported. And so we became incorporated in 2007 and we became an official 501c3 nonprofit in 2008 with a mission to increase participation of females in outdoor activities. So we do programs like Get the Girls Out, which are inclusive and encouraging ways for people to just get out, try something new, give back and share something they love to do like skiing, stand up paddle boarding, mountain biking, all that kind of stuff. Nice. We do outdoor education to give technical skills to people. So maybe it's uh, tying knots or uh, figuring out how to fix your bike for yourself or um, wilderness first aid, that kind of thing. And we also do youth initiatives. So um, we work with Boys and Girls Club, Girls Inc., any other kind of youth group around the country that don't currently have outdoor activities. We try to link them up with all our volunteers and the energy that we have. That's awesome. And so on the youth initiative side of things, that's where you guys have teamed up with Alta recently with She Jumps Into the Canyon, correct? Exactly. Alta is a phenomenal place that we were able to start this program and now we're looking at being able to expand it nationally. But we work with Boys and Girls Club kids and take them up here to Alta four Saturdays in March, give them all the rentals they need, give them lessons, we teach them how to ski. It's super fun and we could not do it without Alta. So you mentioned that you love to cook. And I know for a fact that you are actually a personal chef and or chef at the Wildcat Chalets up here at Alta. Tell it's, us about that. It's true. So uh, I met this phenomenal guy named Bob Allen about six years ago. And he runs the Wildcat Chalet. It's right here at the bottom of Westford Ho. Phenomenal place to, see, to stay. It's luxury accommodation. And Bob inspired me to just really take cooking to the next level. And now I do in-home chef services up here at Alta. And, you know, we have guests that have come back and they stay at the Wildcat Chalet every year the same week every year for like they've been coming for 15 years so it's a really cool way to get to be a part of people's alta experience and ski with them on the mountain and like show them around and then cook them delicious food whenever they get home off the mountain so really quick what's your favorite meal to make oh wow that's such a tough one i just was asked that today um i think anything with coconut oil i love coconut oil <laughs> sounds very delicious <laughs> one day we were out of butter so we used coconut oil <laughs> And the rest is history. <laughs> All right, so you mentioned traveling is one of your passions, and South America is one of the destinations that you've been to. Um, tell us about what you've been doing when you're down there. Um, let's see, so I started working down there as a guide for Casa Tours um, about four years ago. And uh, this last couple summers, I've actually been working doing a race called Avalanche in El Volcan. And it's a race from the top of this active volcano all the way to the bottom, as fast as you can go. I work as an organizer and doing like media and PR for it. Uh, but also, yeah, working as a guide, it was super fun, just traveling around, helping people figure out Chile and show them the ski areas, do some backcountry, side country, that kind of stuff. Okay, we're gonna do a little rapid fire. Like, I'm gonna ask you questions, you're gonna fill in the blank with your answers. Okay, All ready, right? ready, I'm Are ready. ready, I'm totally ready. Okay, your favorite part about Alta is? Devil's Castle. Nice. It's beautiful. Your favorite run at Alta is? Hi, hi boy, hi wrestler. Awesome. awesome. Yeah. One piece of gear you can't live without is? Boot liners. Ooh, good one, good one. <laughs> Not the usual, but I like Pretty that. Pretty crucial. Favorite kind of music is? Classic rock. Classic rock, awesome. Your favorite type of food is? Southwest, Mexican, New Mexican, that's so. Yep, totally. High five or handshake? High five all the time. Sometimes in unprofessional ways. I don't know. I just like, oh, <laughs> nice to meet you. Oh, I mean, I check. Okay. <laughs> Back to she jumps. 
Let's talk about the expansion of She Gems. After this initial idea, how did it get its start and where do you see it going from here? Well, um, so I moved out here after college in 2007 and um, basically I walked into Connie's office, at head of marketing at Alta, and said, I have this dream. I've, this, these are the programs that we've already done and this is She Jumps, this is what we stand for and I really want to do this program with Boys and Girls Club kids. And she signed on right away and said, let us know what you need. And that really gave, I think, She Jumps confidence to start growing these programs in other places. And now we have seven regions around the country and regional coordinators that help to develop these events all over the place. And it's just amazing, fly fishing, stand up paddle boarding, climbing, all sorts of stuff, just working with the community to bring it together. And I think it kind of started here at Alta. So that's, that's great. Nice. All right, folks, this has been On The Lift With. I'm Joe Johnson. This is Claire Smallwood with She Jumps. Check them out at shejumps.org. Check us out at alta.com. We'll be back next week with somebody else on a different lift, or heck, we might even be back on this lift. Either way, check us out next time on The Lift With. We'll talk to you later.